Hello. Uh. Hello. Hello. There you have it. Now I just need to know if the game. Hello. <laughs> if the game is sound sound is working, but. Mm. Let me see if anyone is on the stream. Maybe. Ah, hello, Raccoon. Raccoon, could you do me a favor and tell me if the if the sound <laughs> you are checking the archives? What did you see that you found interesting? Maybe you can talk about it for a while. Hello, black failing, falling, I guess, not failing. <laughs> How are you? You are good. So am I. I'm meeting finally. It's 5.30 here. And I haven't... Ah! You are about to see me fight um, Kenji. The elusive man. <laughs> ah, well. Yeah, we shall be going for at least another few hours. I don't think this game is going to last that long. I may end up playing the Old Republic for a while. Okay, mm, Raccoon or, or Black, could you tell me if the sound of the game is working? Ah, you got the new DLC! It is working, thank you. Yeah, I saw that um, Twitch for a reason was telling people not to stream that. Not to stream it. Alright, then let's continue. The child. Are you kidding me? So yes, I was saying I don't understand why they attack before it is clear that organic civilization will fall. In particular, in, the, in this cycle, there was no there was no threat from mechanics or synthetics. The guests were contained. And if you believe the 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 whole thing, the guests were the first intelligence to be created, mm, synthetic intelligence to be created in this cycle. But Sovereign was trying to destroy the the civilization of the galaxy before that even happened. If you believe that he is behind the Ragnai, as the Queen does. If the Ragnai were a Reaper plot, then the Reapers were trying to destroy the Asari and the Salarians and the Turians even before they had created uh, autonomous machines. On the other hand, if you listen to what the Prothean says, in his cycle they were winning the war against the Synthetics. Ha! They were going to put the music man as the final boss. <laughs> that would have been interesting. Yeah, it, it would be like uh, fighting Psycho Mantis or something in in MSG M Metal MGS. Yeah. 
So, in that case, you could say maybe the Protheans, but the Protheans were winning the war. That's what he says, the, the Javik guy. They were winning the war, and when they thought they had vanquished the mechanics, then the Reapers appeared out of nowhere. So, this is not a solution, this is bullshit, because they are not trying to see if organic life can go beyond the cycle of destruction that they have seen and the leviathans also saw they are cutting cutting the evolution of organic civilization short of even accomplishing of even accomplishing the the feat of creating a separate race of machines that is crazy Yeah, it's amazing how time stands still, isn't it, Wami? <laughs> okay. Let's start uh, asking these people. Exactly, Raccoon. They are forcing the cycle, the Reapers. They are not carefully studying it and looking for signs or even the evidence that history is going to repeat itself they are forcing the cycle they are making it happen instead of looking it's like you you say that there is a prophecy the prophecy says every synthetic civilization will kill its organic creators and then you start watching eon after eon and nothing goes then you say, ah, my prophecy is not coming about, then I shall take matters into my own hands and I attack the organic civilizations. <laughs> that is ridiculous. Uh, okay. Let's go. You said you're the catalyst, but what are you? A construct. An intelligence designed eons ago to solve a problem. I was created to bring balance, to be the catalyst for peace between organics and synthetics. So you're just an AI? In as much as you are just an animal, I embody the collective intelligence of all Reapers. But you were created. Correct. By who? By ones who recognized that conflict would always arise between synthetics and organics. I was first created to oversee the relations between synthetic and organic life, to establish a connection. But our efforts always ended in conflict, so a new solution was required. <laughs> the Reapers. Precisely. Yeah, there you go. That is the the intelligence the Leviathans were talking about. Ah, you hate the elusive man, Black. Black. On the other hand, I adore him. He, yeah. If I were to be a character in this, I wouldn't be Shepard. I would be the elusive man. <laughs> Quite frankly, yeah. If I had <laughs> the chance. I would do uh, some things different, but overall more elusive man than Shepard. <laughs> I met your creators. They told me what you did to them. We did as we were expected. They said you betrayed them, that you turned them into Harbinger. When they asked that I solve the problem of conflict, they failed to understand they were part of the problem themselves. The flaws of their organic reasoning could not perceive this. They lacked the foresight to understand their destruction was part of the very solution they required. Well, they've joined this war now. And I welcome their involvement. I am only facilitating their request. This is like, uh, like some kind of up optimistic Skynet or something. Yeah, some sort of strange reasoning. 
led it to believe that destroying his creators would ensure the... I don't even understand why. Because if the Leviathans didn't create the Reapers, how could this thing come to a conclusion that every single organic civilization would be destroyed by its synthetic creators? I don't understand. Ah, you choose them to destroy them. Hmm. I don't understand. That, that's the very... That's the very antithesis of what he is proposing. There was an organic civilization that realized that other civilizations couldn't find balance. So they create something to find the balance they have already achieved. And instead of uh, putting some plan into motion, the AI decides to destroy them. Starting starting the very cycle it was not the organics that started the cycle it was this fucking AI <laughs> that is ridiculous okay yeah someone programmed this shit badly badly it needs to be disconnected where did the reapers come from did you create them my creators gave them form. I gave them function. They, in turn, give me purpose. The Reapers are a synthetic representation of my creators. Leviathan. Yes. They created me to oversee the relations between synthetic and organic life. To establish a connection. They became the first true Reaper. They did not approve, but it was the only solution. You've said that before, but how do the Reapers solve anything? Organics create synthetics to improve their own existence, but those improvements have limits. To exceed those limits, synthetics must be allowed to evolve. They must, by definition, surpass their creators. The result is conflict, destruction, chaos. It is inevitable. Reapers harvest all life, organic and synthetic. Preserving them before they are forever lost to this conflict. Okay, yeah, this is a good question. We're at war with the Reapers right now. You may be in conflict with the Reapers, but they are not interested in war. <laughs> I find that hard to believe. When fire burns, is it at war? Is it in conflict? Or is it simply doing what it was created to do? We are no different. We harvest your bodies, your knowledge, your creations. We preserve it to be reborn in the form of a new reaper. Like a cleansing fire, we restore balance. New life, both organic and synthetic, can once again flourish. Okay, that's illogical to extreme in my opinion. They are not a tool, they have self-awareness. A tool cannot choose. A tool has no personality, a tool has no thoughts. And obviously the Reapers can reason. They have been doing that for millions of years, and so can this piece of shit. So they are not a tool, they are choosing to do this, you know, before their own purpose. Yeah, or let's say against their own purpose, I would, I would pause it. That is amazing how deluded this AI is. What do you know about the Crucible? The device you refer to as the Crucible is little more than a power source. However, in combination with the Citadel and the Relays, it is capable of releasing tremendous amounts of energy throughout the galaxy. It is crude, but effective and adaptive in its design. 
Who designed it? You would not know them, and there is not enough time to explain. We first noted the concept for this device several cycles ago. With each passing cycle, the design has no doubt evolved. Why didn't you stop it? We believe the concept had been eradicated. Clearly, organics are more resourceful than we realized. And there you go again! There you go again. They suppose and they are uh, trying to find a solution. The catalyst is the solution, not the catalyst, the crucible is the solution, and they were trying to eradicate the solution from the face of the galaxy. Why? Why were they trying to do that? If not prevent the organics from having an alternative to getting destroyed every few thousand years. Yeah, the AI is trying to convince us of something that is not true, that it is interested in preserving life when it is really only focused on destroying destroying its creators and from then on every organic that dares look into the sky and go in search of the stars the defining characteristic of organic life is that we think for ourselves make our own choices you take that away we might as well be machines just like you you have choice more than you know the fact that you are standing here the first organic ever proves it but it also proves my solution won't work anymore so now what we find a new solution why are you telling me this why help me you have altered the variables what do you mean? The crucible changed me, created new possibilities, but I can't make them happen. If there is to be a new solution, you must act. It is now in your power to destroy us. But be warned. Others will be destroyed as well. The Crucible will not discriminate. All synthetics will be targeted. Even you are partly synthetic. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's trying to... to find that reasoning for his own logic. And there you go. There you go. He just said that the crucible changed the variables. But the crucible is not a new thing. The crucible is an old idea. Therefore, if, if it had taken into account the crucible before, new possibilities should have been taken into consideration before this fucking moment. Instead of allowing them to build the crucial and see what happens, it tried to destroy the crucial to prevent his solution from being uh, made obsolete. It was preserving his, yeah, his logic instead of his purpose. It, it has been misguided for a while, this piece of shit. What exactly will happen? Your crucible device appears to be largely intact. However, the effects of the blast will not be constrained to the Reapers. Technology you rely on will be affected, but those who survive should have little difficulty repairing the damage. There will still be losses, but no more than what has already been lost. Except the Reapers. Don't you see his stupid reasoning? The Reapers are supposedly the embodiment of, 
of everything that has come before this point in time, countless races, civilizations, millions of years of galactic history, and there will be losses, but no more that has already lost. No, you will lose everything that has been accumulated over that period of time. The Reapers, for all their uh, problems, do, do represent that much history, the history of the galaxy and the pinnacle of technological evolution. So that will be lost. Fucking stupid piece of shit. But the Reapers will be destroyed? Yes, but the peace won't last. Soon, your children will create synthetics, and then the chaos will come back. There has to be another way. There is. You could instead use the energy of the Crucible to seize control of the Reapers. So the elusive man was right after all. Yes, but he could never have taken control. Because we already controlled him. But I can? You will die. You will control us, but you will lose everything you have. Okay. Yeah, tell me why. How can I control the Reapers if I'm dead? Your corporeal form will be dissolved, but your thoughts and even your memories will continue. Your connection to your kind will be lost, though you will remain aware of their existence. Okay, as I have said before, my shepherd or shepherd overall is not beyond dying for the cause, giving something up. On the contrary, she has already died before once, and yeah, no sacrifice is too great, I said. Well, if our body is the ultimate sacrifice, we will do it. Nevertheless, <laughs> you will remain aware of their existence, so I will continue living in the future. But the Reapers will obey me? Yes. We will be yours to control and direct as you see fit. There is another solution. Synthesis. And that is... Add your energy to the crucibles. The chain reaction will combine all synthetic and organic life into a new framework, a new DNA. Explain how my energy can be added to the crucible. Your organic energy, the essence of who and what you are, will be broken down and then dispersed. To do what, exactly? The energy of the Crucible, released in this way, will alter the matrix of all organic life in the galaxy. Organics seek perfection through technology. Synthetics seek perfection through understanding. Organics will be perfected by integrating fully with synthetic technology. Synthetics, in turn, will finally have full understanding of organics. It is the ideal solution. Now that we know it is possible, it is inevitable we will reach synthesis. Why couldn't you do it sooner? We have tried a similar solution in the past, but it has always failed. Why? Because the organics were not ready. It is not something that can be forced. You are ready, and you may choose it. Okay. 
This is an interesting solution. Exactly. That's the whole point. Preserving preserving past cycles in reaper form. But if you destroy the reapers then all that is all that is lost. That's why his logic is flawed. At least from his own perspective, from mine that, that there is no no real contradiction. It does, it does. And I don't understand exactly what that means. Because I remember, I remember what... What Javik said. Javik said that in his cycle, someone tried this. The, the race that uh, the race that that got uh, in a war with machines they tried this they were limited in their own capabilities to save their own world how long I'll say 20 minutes Birlomi yeah and he said that they, they combined technology directly into their bodies and then the AI that controlled those uh, technological parts to cover the body so I don't know if that's a good decision Yeah, I, I don't know. It's too risky. Because they... It's like the Matrix or something. <laughs> it's it's opening the, the way to... Opening the way to getting controlled that much easier. Yeah, one of the talks in the Normandy, he says that. It would be just letting your brain be vulnerable. Yeah, I don't like that. Let's go with this, but I don't like that. I don't know. Why not? Synthetics are already part of it. Can you imagine your life without them? And there will be peace. The cycle will end. The Reapers will cease their harvest. And the civilizations preserved in their forms will be connected to all of us. Synthesis is the final evolution of all life. The paths are open. But you have to choose. That is a lie. So be it. What? The cycle continues. What the fuck? <laughs> Did I just do? Okay, this is bullshit. <laughs> If you are hearing this, then there is still hope. Hope that you can avoid the same mistakes we made. Okay. We fought the Reapers, but we failed to stop them. We did everything we could. We built the crucible, but it didn't work. 
We fought as a united galaxy, but it wasn't enough. I only hope the information in this capsule is enough to help you before it's too late. <laughs> My is Dr. Liara Tassoni. Herein lies the recounting of our war with the Reapers. That was ridiculous. Okay. I'm going to reload that. Because I didn't want to do that. It's a stupid shit. <laughs> Who would have guessed it would take it so badly? Fucking child. Okay, I'll be back in a moment. When I'm at the same point in time. How did Bio were allow that to happen? Okay. Alright, I'll be back in a moment. <laughs> 